Hello, Sagittarius, and welcome to Blunt Sagittaro. My name is Robin, and Sajay, today we're going to do a reading about the person on your mind. Let's talk about this person, shall we, Saji? Let's find out, first of all, what they want from this connection. Excuse me, what you want from this connection, what they want from this connection. Talk about their feelings in the present moment and what actions you can expect here in the near future. Let's talk about this person on your mind. Spirit guys, let's get down to business. All right, we have reflection. Being away from you has allowed me to gain clarity. So some kind of, well, here's space. I need more time to think. Okay. I'm still trying to heal and guilty. I feel pain from the damage that I've caused. And on the bottom, we have habit. I don't know if I will ever change. Looks like you have a very withdrawn or avoidant person here. Someone who's having a difficult time, uh, well, figuring things out. Let's see what's going on. Let's talk about this connection. I'm just going to move these because I think I'm going to run out of space here. All right. I hope those are all on camera. All right. Let's get down to business, Sajay. And Sajay, for those of you who are interested, I am open for personal readings. If you want one. The link is in the description box below. All right, let's get down to business. What you want, not a swords. What they want is the Empress, baby. All right, their feelings are justice. Wow, we could be dealing with the Taurus Virgo. We have Libra energy. All right, what are their actions? What can Sajay expect? Well, the Four Cups. Okay, there's the Eight of Swords. They are thinking a lot about you and this connection. I feel like you are too. Uh, you guys are both thinking a lot about each other. <laughs> Hold on, where's my clarifiers? They're buried over here, baby. All right, let's grab them. Nine of Swords is what you want. So let's talk about this. What is the Nine of Swords? What does Sajay want? The Nine of Swords is worry, anxiety, fear. It's the past. Worrying about the past, worrying about the future. What else we got? What? Do you... Five of Wands. The Ten of Swords. Wow. And there's the Two of Swords. There's the Three of Cups and the Page of Swords. Um, okay, so I do feel you might be, the Page of Swords is one of two things. I feel you might be checking them out. Maybe looking at old photos of them or looking at them online, seeing what's up in their life. I do feel there's a separation here. It's very obvious. We're speaking to two people who are clearly separated in some form, some manner. Um, I do feel you're conflicted. You're conflicted about this ending. You might be conflicted about how you feel here with the Five of Wands and the Ten of Swords and the Nine of Swords. You might be uncertain of where things stand, uncertain of where things going, uncertain of where they live, they're thinking. I feel you want to overcome that, but I also get a sense of confusion and your energy is not certain if this can go anywhere, not certain what you want. So I just feel like you're really thinking about what it is that you want from this connection. I don't think anything's set in stone here. And, and there's the eight of wands. You do want to move forward. I think one way or the other, one way or the other. Um, I do feel you want to progress forward here with or without this person, but at least get out of this stagnancy of this confusion. I feel there's a lot of confliction and confusion here. And you want that to come to an end and either get closure and move forward or progress forward with this connection, this relationship. You want to know where you stand. You want some answers. Now the Empress is what they want. What does that mean? <laughs> is that you? Is that them? What does this Empress energy talk to us, baby? Talk to us, right? Well, that really flew. I'm going to have to get up off my lazy motherfucking ass and go chase down that card. We have the Queen of Swords. Whoa. We have the Knight of Swords in reverse. That's falling. My cards are falling. We have the Five of Cups. Hold on. Why are they falling? <laughs> what is going on? What was wrong with my cards? All right, we have the Queen of Cups. Hold on a second. Let me chase down this card. Do they continue to fall? Or are they standing still? Yeah. Uh, we have the Magician in reverse. Well, what's this one now? Three of Cups. They know your value. The thing is, it's like I get this... Um, with the Queen of Swords here, they're trying, there's two queens here, first of all, and there's the Empress. Side, your person has a lot of feminine energy in their energy. These could be friends, this could be family members. I feel that there's a choice here that they need to make. I kind of get the feeling this is their energy. Try to follow their heart more so than their mind. Um, there's the Six of Cups. They're trying to cut some, there's the King of Swords. Yeah. They're trying to cut something out from the past. They recognize what they want is you. The Empress energy. So you are the Empress with all these people here. It took me a while to kind of get through what the fuck's going on here. Um, they're not talking to you, though, with the Magician in reverse and the Knight of Swords in reverse. They're making the choice. You know, when people don't talk, it is a choice. And they're making the choice to not talk to you right now. They're making the choice to try and listen to their heart over their mind. They're um, trying to turn something from the past and get... I saw that as the Five of Cups, but that's the Six of Cups. I feel like there's a fucking trickery going on here. What is that? I saw something totally different. And there's the strength. They want to return. They want to progress. They see you in a very positive light here. Um, but your person is really trying, like I said, I just get the feeling they're trying to find their heart over their mind. Um, 
and they're making the conscious choice not to talk to you right now. What they want is to progress forward. Um, they want to return. There's a six of cups. They see you. Well, we're going to see how they see you. But right now, they're making the choice not to talk to you. They're healing. They're focusing on themselves, but they're thinking a lot about you. So let's talk about this justice. That's their feelings. Let's talk about that. What does it all mean? Knight of Swords is upright this time. Okay. So how are they feeling about Saji right now? King of Cups. Whoa. The Six of Swords. There's the Six of Cups again. So, well, remember we had the Knight of the Queen of Cups over here, and now we have the King of Cups. They think you're their divine counterpart. I think they want to marry you here, which is really fucking mind blowing. Because, um, what is up with your motherfucking person here, Sad J? So, the King of Cups and the Knight of Swords, they want to rush in, they want to sweep you off your feet. They see you as their divine partner, as their divine counterpart, as the Empress, the Queen of Cups, to the King of Cups, justice. They want to do right by you. They want to create balance. They see you as being very fair, very ethical, very honest, very balanced, very grounded in your energy. They want to get in their car, motorcycle, train, plane, automobile. They want to get in their vehicle. Could be an e-bike. Oh my God, did you hear about that e-bike in Toronto? It like lit on fire on one of the subways or something and caused like, a, the, I don't know, there was a fire in a public facility because of an e-bike and a... It's funny because I was just talking about e-bikes and kind of want one. <laughs> and when I saw that, I was like, somebody's getting on a fucking e-bike. I don't know what I'm going on. So on an e-bike and coming to get you. Um, they want to sweep you off your feet. They see you as their divine counterpart, as the right person for them. But there is something holding them back, but they want to come forward. We have the Six of Swords. They want to come towards you. There could be distance here with the Six of Swords. Um, they want to sweep you off your feet. They see you as their divine counterpart, the perfect person for them. They want to do right by you. So their actions, though, are the Four of Cups. What is this? That's pretty much the card of uh, no action. <laughs> That's the card of like looking at you. I see you. I look at you, but I ain't doing anything. Six of cups. Wow. Can these cards come out any more in this reading? <laughs> uh, they want to rush in. There's the pages. But they're going to... The world, the eight of pentacles, and the devil. You could be with the Capricorn, air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, nine of swords, the ten of wands. They're burning and stress, but they want to do what they're doing are very different. They want to rush in. They want to sweep you off your feet. They want to make things happen. They want to return into your life. But instead, they're spying on you, watching you. I think you guys are both looking at each other here. It's like I'm seeing like a movie where the girl's laying in bed and the dude's laying in bed or the girl, the girl, boy, boy, don't care. There's two people laying in bed and there's like a split screen and they're both looking at photos of each other, looking at each other online, but they're not talking. <sighs> That's what I see. I don't see them doing nothing. What they want to do and what they're doing is very different. Yeah, there's a three of cups. But I do feel that there might be a reunion or something going forward in the future. Okay, in the present energy, in the near future, there's nothing going on here, Sag. They're thinking about you. You're thinking about them. Um, and they're not taking any action at all. So we're going to grab some oracles. We're going to see if that changes here in a month and see how things progress. But a Sag, I need to surrender too when it comes to this person on their mind. Miracles. <laughs> okay, okay, some okay. Mm, be open to miracles occurring in your life. Feel and know that these events are real. Let go of any resistance and banish any doubt that miracles can happen. Miracles happen to the people who believe miracles happen. So make sure you believe in them and you will see them in your life. All right, what's the current connection between Sajay and this person on their mind? Signs. Watch out for signs leading you to true love. So pay attention to numbers, to little insects, little reptiles, little things that you don't normally see, even the birds and your dreams. There could be something, you know, just pay attention to the signs. You know what the signs are, baby. If you see their name and lights as you're walking down the street, that's a big sign. <laughs> okay, let's get these lover oracles and let's see what messages come out with this. Spirit guides, what messages you want to pass along about this connection with Sajay and the person they're thinking about the most here. What do we got? What do we got? I want to be alone. Oh, I don't want to be alone. Interesting. I did read it that I want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Yeah, they desire you very physically here. I'm not allowed to say that word on YouTube. I can get in trouble. <laughs> you are too nice and I don't deserve your kindness. Wow. Your person, person's definitely feeling some kind of way. Yeah, Sad J. Okay, okay. Well, I'm not going to use that deck. Let's grab this deck and let's get your potential outcome. Now, when I say potential, there is always free will. You're going to make the decisions you're going to make, and so are they. And when I say, oh, come, let's see where you guys are in a month. Let's see how things are progressing. Let's see how things are doing. Let's talk about it. Where are you and this person in a month? Is anything happening? Are you still staying stagnant? Are you guys just thinking about each other? Spying on each other? It's the Knight of Swords in reverse again. Hmm. 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 Okay. What else we got here? 
We got the hanged man. Wow. We have the three of pentacles. There's the queen of wands. There's you. There's the nine of wands. There's the hanged man. There's the star. What's under that? The eight of wands. Whoa. There's the ten of swords. There's the four of wands. I don't really see anything changing, Sag. I'm sorry to say that. What I see is you just kind of focusing on work, focusing on your friends and family. We have the knight of swords in reverse and we have the hanged man. We have very stagnant energy with this person. I don't know what they're going through, but they're going through some shit and they're really not pursuing this. I see them as the Nine of Wands, very guarded. They have a lot of walls up. They've been battered, bruised. They really are just focusing on healing themselves, but they're watching you. They're spying on you. They're looking at you. What I see and what they want and what they're doing are different. I think that they're having a very difficult, there it is. They're having a very difficult time dealing with something. And I just see your person healing, Sag. I don't see them, no, Strength, Ace of Wands. They want you bad. That's a thing. <laughs> they want you bad. What they want, what they're doing are very different. There's a lot of fantasizing. There's a lot of energy wanting to come towards you, seeing as, you know, you're the apple of their eye type of energy. Uh, but what I just see is you focusing on, on work, focusing on your friends and your family. And I see this person spying on you, watching you, looking at you, checking you out, but they're not doing anything. They're stuck. We have the Knight of Swords in reverse, the Hanged Man. I don't see any change in this connection from where it is in the present moment. I just see two people still thinking about each other. And I don't see any progress. I see stagnancy. So sad, I'm sorry to say that. Uh, that's what's come out. <laughs> that's what you guys want to say today. That's what's going on in the collective with the person that you're thinking about the most. There's no movement here in the near future. So I do hope that changes soon. But that's what's up. That's what I got. That's what's going down. So sad, Jay, if you like your reading, if you like my style, I do ask that you like, comment, subscribe. Helps my channel to grow. Thank you, Sagittarius. I truly, truly appreciate your support. Let's close your reading off today. With a yes or no question. What's the answer for Sajay? Yes or no? It's a no. I wasn't sure what way. I paused, but I checked it out. It's a no. That's what I have, Saj. I really do wish you the best of luck. Until next time.